Hey cuties, so in today's role playing video, my kids were late to middle school. So wait, Ava, what are you guys doing? We're watching a video on award show, mom. It's super good. Yeah, Zoe and I are betting on who's gonna win. Whoever calls it gets five whole dollars. Well, that is great, and I am so glad you girls are practicing your childhood gambling skills. Let's not forget that it's a school night, and you girls need to get up early. Mom, we're in middle school now. I think we know when to wake up in the morning. That's awesome, but I also recall every morning having to pull you guys out of your beds by your feet as you girls are drooling onto your pillows, and then me getting stuck in the drop-off line on the way out because every other parent and child are late. You are so overreacting, Mom. Oh, I'm sure I am because I definitely wasn't late to work this morning because you guys missed the bus. And then I had to drop you guys off. And then once again, I was stuck in the aftermath of the morning drop-off. Well, today is a Monday. It's different. Is Monday different than the rest of the weekdays? Duh. Okay, I am not going to sit and argue with you girls. I am telling you right now. Next commercial, I want the TV off and you girls are upstairs brushing your teeth. Mom. Come on, I don't want to hear it in the morning that you girls are tired. We're practically adults now. Just let us finish the awards and we'll be upstairs getting ready for bed in no time. Fine, if I have your word on it, I am choosing to trust you, okay? So please, don't make me regret this in three in the morning when I find you still passed out on the couch. You have our word. Don't worry, that won't happen. Yeah, we would never fall asleep during a video award show. Many hours later. Is it? Oh my gosh, it's three in the morning. Did I fall asleep? Oh heck no, those two hooligans gave me their word. They said they wouldn't pass out on the couch. Ugh, now I'm gonna have to go put them to bed in the middle of the night after I whoop both of their booties. Girls? Huh? What? You sure that's me? Mommy, mommy, help! Oh, you girls are gonna need my help, all right. Yourself. I'm taking it. The video awards ran a little bit late. Or are you girls just watching infomercials? Because it's three in the morning. What's an infomercial? Never mind that. Are your teeth even brushed? Oh, come on, Mom. What is the big deal? So when we fell asleep, we're home. We're safe. Oh, you're home. Nobody said you were safe. Seriously, we fell asleep on the couch in our own house. Oh, no. Aren't we the worst in the world? Some people are hooligans. I'll tell you what the big deal is. Now I have to get you girls washed up and get you girls into bed. And by the time I'm going to be back, in bed, I'm gonna be exhausted. Never mind three hours from now when you girls are so tired that you're not gonna wake up. And then once again, you're gonna be late for school. That's not gonna happen this time. We are perfectly well rested. Oh, okay. Well, then why don't you head up to bed then? I'll expect not to see you still asleep in a few hours. No problem, Mom. Yeah, have a little faith. The next morning. so exhausted. I just need like five more minutes or five more hours. I mean, whatever helps. Please, why am I so tired? Oh, that's right. Because my lovely kids had me up to like four in the morning putting them to sleep. Oh, well, at least they said that they'll be on time today and I have nothing to worry about. Actually, there are many things that I worry about about that statement. I better go make sure that they're awake. Meanwhile, oh, I knew it. Get out of bed. Help, help. I'll call someone, all right, like the adoption center when I go drop you off. Zoe, you said you weren't going to do this today. I say a lot of things, Mom. Where is your sister? Do you know she's ready? Well, unless she was in my pillow, I really can't help you. That's it. No more video awards for you two ever. You need to get up right now and start getting ready. Mom, I'm exhausted. I don't think that's going to happen. Oh, yeah? And why is that? Because I can't really stand up right now. I'm, like, too tired. Okay, I am going to deal with you in a minute. But right now, I got to see what's going on with your sister. Moments later. Ava? Ava! You know what? Maybe this is a good thing. My responsible daughter is probably already in the bathroom getting ready for her day. Wow, I am so proud of her. What? Ava! No, 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 no. How did I not notice that you were in here? Wait, have you been in here all night? Ava, come on. Get up. You know you're not supposed to be sleeping in here. I want me. No, no more minutes. You need to get up now. You told me last night to have a little faith. And now I may never have faith again. Get up. But I'm so sleepy. That's because you were watching the award show until 3 in the morning. And I see no movement or plans of getting up. You and your sister both need to get up, get dressed, get fed, and then get out the door in less than 30 minutes if you're going to catch the bus. You can just drive us. Come back later, Mom. I'm having an awesome dream. Well, enjoy your dream because reality isn't going to be as kind to you. Well, maybe this will help wake you up. Oh, what the heck, Mom? You just dumped water on me. Well, I'm guessing that it worked. 
because you're waking out of bed now, aren't you? Oh my gosh, why are you trying to ruin my life? We'll discuss that over breakfast. Now move. Meanwhile. Please stay awake so when you're swallowing your breakfast, you don't choke. Ugh, I'm just so tired. Yeah, I'm even more tired. Well, I am the last one who got into bed last night because I had to make sure that you two were settled in. So I think I'm the most tired. Please just finish your breakfast, put your dishes in the sink, and the bus will be here any moment. Ugh, I'm so tired. Ugh. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no sleeping on the floor. And no falling asleep in class either. Or sneaking into the nurse's office to take a nap. I know all the tricks. Now, come on, get your backpacks. Let's go. Uh, Mom, it's like so early. Even a better reason to go to bed earlier tonight. Okay, girls, the bus is here. Now, go on and make it a great day. Uh... Okay, okay, off you go then. Let's go. <sighs> that was the most exhausting morning ever. How am I supposed to go to work and make it through the day when all I want to do is crawl back to bed? Oh, I cannot do this anymore. These girls are killing me. Maybe I just need to go upstairs and take a quick nap. I mean, nobody will even know. Later that same evening. Hey girls, how was school? It was so good. Yeah, super good. We gotta run around the track and gym class today. Well, I am certainly glad you two are nice and energized. Hey, how about we have a little family meeting on the couch here? Uh-oh. Oh, uh-oh. No, uh -oh. I just want to have a talk with you guys. Double uh-oh. Okay, come on, please. About what happened last night? Actually, this morning. Three in the morning, to be exact. We get it, Mom. We were up late last night, and we didn't get to bed till the morning, and we had you up late. We're sorry, and it won't happen again. Actually, that's not what I was going to say at all. Wait, so we're not in trouble? No, you're not in trouble. What I was going to tell you is that I'm going to be changing things up around here. I am not going to be on you girls like a drill sergeant anymore. No telling you to get to bed and go to sleep. From now on, you two get to decide when you want to go to sleep, or even if you you want to at all. Really? Yeah, you can watch TV all night if you want to. And have ice cream? If that's what you want. Wait a minute, this sounds too good to be true. What's the catch? Yeah, there's gotta be a catch. No real catch. The only thing is you have to get yourself up in the morning and ready on time so that you girls can get to school. There it is, the catch. I'm sorry, how is that a catch? I thought you girls would be excited about this. Wait, explain I am gonna step back and leave you girls on your own. You can stay up as late as you want, watch whatever you want. If you don't wanna go to sleep one night, that is totally fine. But you have to be awake in the morning and not late to school. Really? We can stay up as late as we want? Sure, if you can handle it. I am counting on you two being old enough to make those decisions. So from now on, I am not gonna wake up at three to put your sleepy butts back to sleep. But if you're up all night, then you girls have to deal with the consequences. Well, that sounds fair enough. Just one request. Go ahead. Can you Move out of the way, cause the rerun of the video awards is on tonight, and we want to watch what we missed. Sure, go ahead, but don't stay up too. Uh, never mind. What am I saying? You girls can stay up as long as you want. The next morning. remember the last time I slept so well. What a night. I got like eight hours of sleep. When was the last time that happened? Oh yeah, before I had kids. Feels so good to feel refreshed for a change and not like a zombie. I wonder how the girls are doing. You know, I'm gonna choose to have faith in them and believe that they're up. Meanwhile. Ava, Ava, wake up. Five more minutes. No, it's not mom. It's me. Look, we're in big trouble. Oh, uh, we can deal with it later. No, I'm pretty sure we can't. Because we're supposed to be at school in 30 minutes. And I just woke up and you're not even awake yet. So? So we just made a huge deal to mom about how we're going to be responsible and how we get to handle staying up late. And now we're going to be late for school, which is the only thing she asked us not to do. Maybe she won't be mad. Of course she's going to be mad. She's a mom. Moms live for moments like this to prove their kids wrong. Well, what can we do? We already missed the bus. She may have no other choice but to face the wrath of mom. Moments later. Wow, I forgot how easy it is to only pack for myself. Mom, mom, we need to talk to you. Oh, hi, girls. Is everything okay? No, not really. Uh, you were right. We stayed up way too late last night watching TV, and we overslept, and now we're going to be late for school. Yeah, you were right, Mommy. We're not responsible enough yet to get ourselves ready. We still need you to do it. Well, on one hand, I am not thrilled that you girls decided to stay up late. But on the other hand, I'm glad that you girls came to me instead of lying about it. So we will help us. I'm your mom. I may get aggravated from time to time, but I'm always here to help you. Yay, kids, we missed the bus. Oh, no. You don't mean... Moments later. Uh -oh.